Ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of Mr. Tommy R. Mize, Director of Installation Management Command Europe and host for today's special event, Guten Morgen and Willkommen to the Karras Exchange of Command Ceremony. Today, Colonel Christopher R. Danbeck will relinquish command of the United States Army Garrison of Bavaria to Colonel Kevin A. Poole. We extend a sincere welcome to our distinguished guests. Ladies and gentlemen, please stand for the invocation given by Chaplain John McCannon, U.S. Army Garrison of Bavaria's command chaplain, and remain standing for the national anthem of the Federal Republic of Germany and the United States of America. At this time, Colonel Poole will join Colonel Danbeck on the field, where they will make their way towards the aerial platform of Ladder 31. Please direct your attention to the left of the field as the platform is being raised above the parade field. Through this symbolic act, performed prior to the transfer of authority of the garrison, the outgoing garrison commander is able to expeditiously orient and familiarize the incoming garrison commander on locations of key facilities and infrastructure, tenant unit areas of responsibility, installation boundaries, and installation access control points. In 2013, United States Army Garrison Trappinger was transformed to the United States Army Garrison Bavaria. A single garrison with four locations encompassing Trappinger, Milsec, Hornwell, and Garden. In response to the growing rotational force, the training troop presence in U.S. Navy Bavaria established a fifth community to manage garrison resources in the training camp. Trappinger training area was originally created following the activation of the Third Bavarian Army Corps in 1900. After World War II, U.S. Army Europe expanded the role and importance of the training area to meet the increased training needs and increase the facilities to support the troops during training. 2001 brought the start of the build-up of Tower Barrett, formerly East Camp, with new construction, realignment, and renovations to support a brigade combat team. Throughout your training area, was the U.S. Army's largest training area outside the continental United States, providing training at this time, Mr. Tommy R. Wise, host for today's Change in Command ceremony, will join Colonel Danbeck and Colonel Poole as the official party takes their place on the field. The Change of Command is a simple yet traditional event that is rich with symbolism and heritage. The key to the ceremony is the passing of the colors. The very soul of the military unit is symbolized in the colors under which it fights. fights. But they, they represent not only the lineage and honors of the unit, 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 but also the loyalty and unity of its soldiers. soldiers. The custodian, the custodian of, the of the colors is Command Sergeant Major, who is the senior enlisted soldier of the unit and principal advisor to the commander. The Command Sergeant Major, Command Sergeant Major Macho, will pass the colors to Colonel Danden who will in turn pass the color to Mr. Mines. The pass of the color symbolizes the relinquishment of command from Colonel Danbeck. Mr. Mines will then pass the colors to Colonel Poole, charging him with the responsibility for the unit as its new garrison commander. Colonel Poole will then return the colors to the command sergeant major. By the authority of Army Regulation 600-20, paragraph 2-3, the undersigned assumes command of the United, United States, States Army Garrison of Bavaria, effective 12 July 2022. Signed, Devin A. Poole, Colonel, Adjutant General, Commanding. Commanding. 